of the special catfish rigs I'm going to be trying out here today is the catacopter, which is a form of buoyant paternoster rig which has proved effective for catfish. Uh, just describing the rig, from the bottom you have a fairly large lead, three or even four ounces, then a swivel just to stop it twisting, followed by a bead, and then sliding you have a large poly ball, a bead, a short boom which I'll talk about in a minute and another poly ball and a small bead at the top which runs up to a stop knot, in this case made from power gum. And basically what you do is you set the stop knot at the depth that you want to fish, cast out the whole rig and it will come up in the water pushed up by this bottom poly ball up to the knot and it will fish from there in a paternoster style. You fish with a short hook link. In this case, this is about as long as you want to go. In some cases you'd fish shorter, six to 12 inches, with a bit of um, stiff boom tube there just to keep it away from the main line. And the way in which we actually fish that on the, on the rod rest is uh, different from normal as well, which I'll just show you. When the rod's actually cast out, which I won't do now, then what we do is we use a, a butt spike here, which you can push into the ground or you can get ones which screw into the top of a bank stick. Put the rod butt in there and then rest it against an angled bite alarm. So it's a long bank stick with an angle lock which allows you to adjust the angle so it's fished in a beach caster position upright and the aim of that is to keep the line off the water right the way over to the rig so the line's coming up the rod straight out and then it's going straight down minimising tangles. This is the sort of rig that I'd be using generally in deeper water six foot plus. There is some deep water out there that I'm going to fish this rig in today, you can fish it in shallower but certainly in deep water it's an ideal rig and particularly if you're fishing over weed or some waters like Horton, um, the RMC water which you've got depths up to sort of 18 foot plus, it's perfect for fishing in the upper layers of the water in deep water conditions. If you're fishing over weed then what I'd recommend is fishing a fixed two to three foot um, bomb link before you actually have your poly ball on cast the whole thing out and it all comes up to the desired depth. So you can adjust the depth you're fishing at by the position of the stop knot. To demonstrate the buoyancy of this rig, I'm just going to flick it into the margins and you'll be able to see that, bang, the poly balls are straight up to the surface. Now they've come right up the surface because I've lifted the stop knot up well above and you can see that in the water that whole rig would rise straight up in the water and really sit tight against that stop knot that we've put on and the angle of the line with the rod up just keeps the whole rig fairly vertical in the water and minimises the risk of tangles. The other point which I haven't mentioned before and that is in addition to the boom to fish a stiff hook link material. This is Amnesia, one of the low memory monos, there's also ESP stiff rig or gold label stiffy, there's quite a number of uh, types on the market. Again, that just minimises the risk of tangle.